Hello, uh, today I'm going to show you how to manage uh, this Dahua access control devices, a standalone access control with a, an integrated reader, uh, this appearance uh, connected to a computer and managed by Smart PSS Lite. So the first thing you do on Smart PSS Lite is uh, maybe you just do an auto search or if you know the IP address you just key in. So for this case I've done auto search and then I'll select the device and click add. When I click add it will prompt me for the credentials so I'll click in uh, the username and password uh, in that sense then when I click OK uh, I'll realize the device is added as the first device on my list and it is online. Once it's online I'll come to home then under access I'll look at personnel so I can add a personnel uh, by clicking add right here then uh, I key in the ID so I'll use this ID then I key in the name so I'll just use Zef I'll use Zef then you can pick the company the validity if you're using a face recognition you pick face recognition access uh, then I can add a password so I'll use this I'll just confirm this password uh, then uh, I can add a card if I have a card if I don't I don't need to then I can add a fingerprint but first thing I must select the target fingerprint device so once I select this I select device uh, my device will appear here so I select this IP I can use either reader 1 or reader 2 this is reader 1 this is reader 2 based on my wiring uh, which I have another video on the same so I'll just use reader 1 then I press ok so once I press ok then now I click add uh, then click add fingerprint then the device will activate then I press my fingerprint again I remove and press again I remove and press three times then it will say registration successful uh, then I'll find the fingerprint details there then uh, I can add any other information then I click on finish once I have a user created uh, I can go to permission and then create a permission group so I'll just click on add then it will pop up from here so I'll leave it at default then I select the default device I want it to to access so with that then um, so with this door one I click on OK then uh, I have this permission group so what I'll just do is click here on the user icon then I'll add a person to the permission group so the, here is the person so just click like this then click on OK then uh, it will show me the authorization finished issuing and uh, successful one so once it does authorization it means if i press my fingerprint on this device it should be able to give me access if i click on this uh, please note it will turn green meaning access is granted so like that then it unlocks the door so that is how you use smart pss to manage users thank you